Okay, here we are at um, 9923 Holland here in Star. Nice, quiet neighborhood. Beautiful home. Stucco. This home is built by James Clyde. Enter onto travertine floors. Nice little detail, arches. You've got a dining room slash you could make this into an office if you wanted. Ceiling detail is nice. Pocket door here. And double pocket doors there. from the front door where we were at, off to the left, we have bedroom number one. Very high ceilings. I think these are 11 foot ceilings. I had to guess. Um, or 12, I don't know. The, do the doors are the taller doors as well. Bathroom. Tub. Bedroom number two. So the doors in here are that standard size, and then the doors. These doors are the taller ones. Coming back up, I just wanna catch that archway there too. So entering back into the entry area. Off to the right, you have the hallway. That's leading back into that dining room. That's leading into the laundry room. And that direction is gonna be leading into the kitchen. Here's the family room. Kind of one of his signature ceilings. Stone gas fireplace, the built-ins. Really nice space. Kitchen. You got the under cabinet lighting, you got the little lights up there, the top. This is interesting right here, five burner gas range. And then this is the spice rack. It just looks like a decorative, um, just kind of looks like that when it's closed. Spice rack on both sides. Granite counters. Viking oven. I take it the range must be a Viking then too. Yep, the range is Viking as well. And the fridge is Viking. I don't know if the fridge comes with, but it fits perfectly and matches the rest, so I don't know why not. And then over here in the dining area, it's nice you've got this whole built-in I'm going to detour really quick and go outside before we hit the master. This is a self-facing backyard. You got a ceiling fan, you got a covered patio, and the yard's really nice. Lots of nice evergreens, privacy from the neighbors. Oh, I did forget the pantry. 
got a linen over here um, as you're coming into this little area to enter the master. Coffered ceiling with the lights, shutters, really nice big bathroom or bedroom, sorry, really big. We've got a lot of space in between that wall. I don't know what that thing is. I think it's a picture probably being covered up. And this is a king size bed with two nightstands. Well, actually it's a queen size. I think this is queen. But, and then entering into the bathroom, coming in all stone, large soaker tub. It does have the rain glass behind this. I can see. Walk-in shower. Very classic. I think it's the, um, just the selection of the tiles. Um, countertops, everything. It's very neutral. Timeless. Private little loo room with the door. You've got the linen here. And then as you walk in, I want to capture that. It's a arched. Walking into here, you got this little built-in here with the mirror. And then that side is built in for shoes. Another one of these two on this side. So very big, and then it goes directly into the laundry room as well. Nice little dumping area, mud station. Garage is large, but basically a four car garage. Lots of stuff, but for a car. And then I'm coming back around. So I just made a big circle. Here's back to that dining room. Here's back to the kitchen. And I forgot to grab and shove the pantry. It's a nice big pantry area. It does have a plug there. Jack making himself comfortable. <laughs> yeah, there's a lot of architectural detail that really the video's hard to get, but um, yeah, this is a beautiful home.